بتقسمه زي المورس وازاي المورس بتقسم ما بيننا ما بين الثري برانشز اوكي تمام كده طيب دلوقتي الساينس في ستارتنج من جريد 7 بيتقسم لثري برانشز كيمستري وفيزكس وبيولوجي اوكي في الاكزام في الاخر في اخر السنه او في الميدير بيجي لك البيبر على بعضها يعني الكيمستري والفيزكس والبيولوجي كلهم في اكزام واحد كساينس اوكي يبقى تو بيبرز زي ما انتم متعودين من قبل كده من جريد 6 بس كل بيبر في 5 minutes اوكي الكويستشنز بتاعت البرانشز بتبقى ميكسد يعني مثلا مش هتبتدي بالكيمستري وبعد كده الفيزكس وبعد كده البيولوجي لا الكويستشنز كلها بتبقى ميكسد ورا بعض اوكي فخلي بالك ان لسه بقى داخل جريد 7 اوكي آه اللي لسه داخل جريد 7 تخلي بالك وانت بتعمل انسرنج للكويستشنز يو هاف تو واتش ذا تايم خلي بالك من التايم لان كل مثلا البيبر مثلا كلها بتبقى مثلا حوالي 13 بيجز اوكي okay. او 14 يعني في الرينج ده كده تخلي بالك من التايم لان انت معاك كل الـ كل البرانشز هتمتحنهم في ال 45 minutes اللي هي بيبر 1 و 45 minutes بيبر 2 اوكي okay. الـ الـ this year الفريم ورك بتاع جريد 7 متغير عن السنه اللي فاتت لكن في 8 احنا لسه زي ما احنا الفريم ورك القديم فجريد 7 نزل له حاجات كتيره جدا من جريد 8 و هيبقى عليه يعني لما يخش بقى جريد 8 السنه الجايه في الفريم ورك هيبقى نازل عليه حاجات من ناي فلو سمحتوا الناس اللي لسه داخله جريد 7 السنه دي جريد 7 مهمه يعني ممكن السنين اللي فاتت ما كانتش بالكميه الرهيبه في الكونتنت دي لا السنه دي غير خالص نازل جزء كبير جدا من جريد 8 وجريد 9 فما تعتبرهاش ايه يعني انا فراغ ما بين 6 و8 لا اطلاقا هيعتمد عليها جزء كبير جدا في جريد 8 السنه الجايه ما تخش 8 السنه الجايه مش هيبقى عندك وقت ان انت تكفر كل الماتيريال دي من اول وجديد اوكي فالناس ان شاء الله في جريد 7 تهتم كويس جدا بال بال بالكيمستري وفيزكس وبيولوجي الكيمستري كام بالذات دي نزل عليها حاجات كتير جدا من من 8 و9 يو هاف تو تيك كير الناس بقى بتوع 8 طبعا يعني مش محتاجين توصيه احنا من اول السنه لازم نكون مركزين ومتابعين لان الاكزام في شهر 4 فالوقت يعني بيجري بسرعه يعني انت احنا مثلا آه لسه بادئين اهو هتحسوا ان الوقت جرى بسرعه آه فلازم تعمل فولوينج اب عشان في اخر السنه لما تيجي تمتحن في فيزكس وكيمستري وبيولوجي انت بتمتحن حاجات جريد 7 والكريكلم بتاع 8 وكريكلم من 9 كريكلم 9 اوكي okay. فانت محتاج ان من اول السنه كده تفولو اب يعني آه على طول تيتشرز بتوعك علشان اخر السنه نو no واي ان انت هتلحق تخلص من اول وجديد يعني تقول ايه خلاص انا قبل امتحان اخر السنه كده هبتدي ان انا اذاكر الكيمستري وفيزكس وبيولوجي مش هتلحق خالص ان كيمستري وفيزكس وبيولوجي كلهم واخدين جريد 7 و8 و9 مع بعض اوكي فالناس بتاع جريد 8 تهتم كويس جدا وتتابع من الاول والناس بتاع 7 نفس الكلام علشان دلوقتي ال 7 بقت فيها جزء كبير جديد غير السنين اللي فاتت خالص الفريم ورك اتغير خالص فبرضو ان شاء الله نكست يير لما تخش 8 مش هيبقى عندك وقت ان انت تبتدي كله برضو من اول وجديد اوكي okay. دلوقتي اي ويل اكسبلين ليسن كومن بتوين 7 اند 8 7 الجديد و8 اللي اوريدي اللي هو معانا في الفريم ورك القديم اوكي okay. يعني انا هشرحه دلوقتي ده نزل من 8 كان اوريدي موجود وبقى جديد في 7 اوكي ليتس ستارت حد عنده اي كويستشن قبل ما ابتدي؟ ها اي كويستشن يا شباب؟ ديورينج ذا ليسن لو حد عنده اي كويستشن في اي حاجه اسك مي ما تتكسفوش خالص حتى لو دي سيشن يعني كده انتروداكشن سيشن يعني فيل فري تو اسك اي كويستشن ديورينج ذا ليسن بس جاست ريز يور هاندز اوكي؟ حد عنده مشكلة إن أنا هسأل during the lesson؟ أوكي okay, يعني محتاجاكم إن أنتوا تـ interact معايا، اتفقنا؟ أوكي؟ okay. طيب. Uh, I will share the screen. Uh,
Okay, can you see the screen now? يعني تابعوا معايا كده ودي تمام الدنيا اوكي يعني شايفين سامعين كده يعني. Yes, teacher. Yeah, we can see. Okay, طيب تمام. دلوقتي we've spoken before grade four or five. يعني من أول starting من grade four or five, the states of matter, right? We have how many states of matter? We have three states of matter. يعني طيب before starting the state of matter, what is the meaning of matter? Matter anything that has space and volume. Okay. Uh, matter is anything that takes a space and uh, has volume and has mass. Uh, in solid, or liquid, or gas, all the three states, common state of matter. Gases have mass. What do you think? Do gases have mass? Hmm. Yes or no? I need to know what yes. do you think? No. Okay. Uh, yes or no? No. Okay. Uh, who says yes? Hmm. Me, Karim. Okay. Yes, it has mass. Five. How can we know that it has mass? Because it's a matter. Okay, it's a matter type. But we can we can do an experiment. Okay. Five. How we can know that gases have mass? For example, if we have an empty balloon, okay, and we measure the mass of this balloon. خلاص, we have a balloon, empty balloon, we measured its mass. And then we will blow this balloon, okay? After blowing the balloon, the mass stayed the same. If we use sensitive balance, mass balance, what do you think? The mass would stay the same? No. Yes or no? No. no. But why? No. Why? Because it's now we're filled with, filled with what? Air. Yes, it's now filled with air, so air has mass. Okay, a solid, a liquid, a gases, all those three states of matter have mass and takes up a takes up space. Okay, we used before to say that the solid and the liquid and the gas are three different states of matter, and they are made up of what? They are made up of what? Solid, or liquid, or gases. We are built out of what? Filled. Huh? Sorry? Atoms. Particles. Sorry. Uh, uh, you said cells, right? Someone said cells, right? Okay. And cells deep in all are living things. Okay. Cells deep in all are living things. Like in here, in the state of matter, they have not living. Okay, so we cannot say that they are made out of cells. This is absolutely wrong. Okay, cells deep that are the things living things. In the state of matter, as solid, or liquid, or gas, they are made up of particles. They are made up of particles. Yeah, the particles are the building unit of the of any solid or liquid or gas. Yani, for example, مثلاً أنا عندي great walls. Okay. The wall is made up of what? How to build the wall? We can build the wall using what? Using bricks, right? It's the same for the solid or liquid or gases. The building unit of any solid or liquid or gas is particles. Okay? Okay. Uh, Particles دي بقى احنا في 7 و 8 مش هنقول عليها احنا اخدت قبل كده ان they are called particles now I have to know that they are called atoms sorry solid or liquid or gases are called the particles that make solid or liquid or gases are called atoms uh, uh, يعني في earlier stages في 4 or 5 or 6 you used to say particles لا في 7 و 8 they are called atoms Okay, for grade eight, we will يعني a structure of the atoms in details. You are starting from now, the particles, we will call them what? We will call them? Uh, we will call the particles what? Atoms. Atoms. Okay. It's very easy, right? Right. Uh, okay. Yes. Yeah.
I said, مثلا, in oxygen. Oxygen is made of what? Oxygen is a gas, so it's made up of what? Hmm. In oxygen. The gas, it's made up of what? Oxygen A. We have just said that any state of matter is made up of particles and we now we call it atoms. So oxygen is a kind of gas. Oxygen is made up of what? Atoms. Uh, atoms. atoms. Yes, that's what I need to hear. Yeah, but oxygen is made up of atoms. Okay, type. When I say, for example, water. Water is made up of what? Atoms. Of atoms. atoms. Okay, do you understand this? Iron, for example, is made up of what? Larger piece of iron is made up of what? Of atoms. Iron atoms. Okay, do you understand this? Clear? Okay. The um, reality, we will take three names for the substances. Okay. And anti substances are divided into elements, compounds, or mixtures. We will now understand what they mean. When I say, for example, oxygen is made up of oxygen atoms, right? Female oxygen here, another type of atom, how are just oxygen atoms, right? Okay, fine. When I say, for example, gold, gold is made up of what? Mm. Gold atoms, gold atoms, right? Yes. Pure substances. Right. Well, pure substances, we call them elements. The pure substances, which are made of one type of atom, we are call them an, we call them what? An element. Element. We call them an element. Yani in an element. Element, for example, as I said, the oxygen is made up of just the oxygen atoms. Well, oxygen is an element. Why do we call it an element? Because it's made up of one type of atom, which is oxygen. Gold is made only of gold atoms. So it's made up of one type of atom, so we call it an element. Okay? Uh, for example, carbon. The carbon is made up of just the carbon atoms. So we call it an element. Element. Yes, in water, who can say? Uh, the water is made up of what? Very easy, huh? Two hydrogen atom and one yes. oxygen atom. Yes, the water is made up of H2O, right? Right. Yes, H2O. This means that water, yes, yes, Suhaila. Have a question? I'm not going to no, I'm not going to answer, but. Sorry? I'm not going to answer, but to answer. Um, can't you hear well, yes, Raila? Could you write this by what we have just said? Uh, sound not clear, Um Okay, the water, which is H2O, is made up of, uh, of two types of atoms, hydrogen and oxygen. Right? Okay. Yes. Can we say that water is an element? Yes or no? No. No. Uh, no, why? Uh, who could say why? It's a molecule. Oh, okay, this is an adv <laughs> advanced information. <laughs> for, for what I have just said, يعني, from what I have explained, why you can't say that water is an element? Because it has because more it than has it has two uh, two, two different types of atoms, yes, more than one element. That's right, excellent. If, uh, and water, we couldn't say that water is an element. Why? Because. Has two different types. Say water is an element because it's made up of two different types of atoms bonded together, or joined together as the water. Okay, so what do we call water? We call water a compound. It's a compound. You understand that? I will say another example. And you will say if it's an element. Sorry? 
Can I ask you a question? Yes, yes. What is the difference between a compound and a molecule? Okay. Um, the compound and molecule, there is no difference between them. I am just understanding what is a molecule. Okay? Okay. احنا الدفرنس بين كومباوند اوكي كده خلينا المولكيول دلوقتي ماشي اوكي خلي المولكيول دلوقتي هو الاكسبلينت وين اي فينيش ات وود بي مور كلير بس ما فيش كومباريزن ما بين المولكيول والكومباوند دلوقتي الكومباريزن ما بين ايه الاليمنت اند كومباوند دي اليمنت يس دي اليمنت از ميد اب اوف جاست وان تايب اوف اتوم اوكي واي ذا كومباوند از ميد اب اوف ديفرنت تايبس اوف اتومز بوندد Together, okay. When I say carbon dioxide, the gas which is called carbon dioxide, do you know it? Yes. Hi. It's made up of what? Huh? You remember uh, for grade six um, when you took the uh, equation of the photosynthesis? I know. Right. Uh, carbon dioxide is is what? CO two, uh, right? CO two. Yes, one carbon atom with two oxygen atoms. Can we say that carbon dioxide is an element or a compound? A compound. Hmm. Yes, a compound. Uh, can someone else name why? Why we call carbon dioxide a compound? Hmm. Why do we call it a compound? Why carbon dioxide? A compound. Hmm. Yes. Because we have two different uh, molecules. Um, uh, also, it have two different atoms. Yes, two different types of atoms, which is carbon and oxygen. Is that clear the difference between an element and a compound? Okay. Is it clear? Yes. Teacher, sorry, I didn't understand the difference between the element and the compound. Okay, again. The element, the substance that is made up of one type of atom. And for example, when I say, um, for example, gold. Gold is made up of one. You have gold. Golden atom, gold what? atom. Gold atoms, right? Right. If you have a piece of, um, for example, uh, iron, this piece of iron is made up of what? Iron atoms. Iron atoms. Yes. Uh, if, we are, if I said oxygen, oxygen is a gas, which is made up of what? Hydrogen and oxygen. No, oxygen only, oxygen gas only, not water. Oxygen gas only. Made up of what? Oxygen. Huh. O2. Oxygen gas. Made up of what? Oxygen atoms. Oxygen atoms, right? So here we yeah. have one type of atom in the substance. Only one type of atom. Okay? So we call this type of substance an element. Okay? What did I mean of element? It's a, uh, it's a substance that is made up of one type of atom, only just one A1 type, yeah, any pure substance, contains only one type of atom. Okay, so this is an element. Okay. So Hayla, if I told you, water is made up of what? Oxygen and hydrogen. Huh. Yes, oxygen and hydrogen. How, how many different types of atoms are here? Two. So, could we say that water is an element? No. No, why? Because here we have two different types of atoms. So we could, at this time, we could call water is a, what is a compound. Com yes, that's right. Okay, do you understand now? Uh, for example, if I told you carbon dioxide, carbon dioxide, in the carbon dioxide, we have carbon and oxygen. We call carbon dioxide is a, is a what? Compound. Compound, why? Yeah. Because it's made up of two different types of atoms, 
bonded together or joined together. Okay, but the compound how just two different atoms? Well, uh, it could be more. What do you think? It could be more. Yes, it could be more could than be two more. different types of atoms. Okay, could be more than two, not just two. It could be more than two types of atoms. Okay. And we have another example. Do you know the table salt that we add to the food? <laughs> okay. The table salt that we add to the food, its uh, chemical name is sodium chloride. The table salt that we use and we add to the food is called sodium chloride. Sodium chloride um, is a compound that is made up of sodium and the chloride. Okay. A sodium chloride is a compound because it's made up of sodium and the chloride. El, el elements, when they make, when they join together and make a compound, the el properties of that el compound are different from the elements. Yani, 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 for example, a table salt, el hoa sodium chloride, sodium only, is a solid substance that cannot be eaten at all. Well, chlorine only, as an element is a gas. When they have joined together, they made the table salt that we could eat. Okay, so the properties of the compound are different from the properties of its elements. The sodium chloride, which is a uh, table salt, is made up of sodium and the chlorine. When the sodium, sodium only as an element is a, a solid substance that cannot be eaten at all. Well, chlorine only is a gas, okay? When they are joined together, they made a compound with new properties. Understand this? Another example, the water muscle. The water is liquid, we could drink. And hydrogen only is a gas. Well, oxygen only as an element is a gas, okay? Could we drink hydrogen only or drink oxygen only? Of course not. When the hydrogen and the oxygen are joined together, they formed a compound with new properties. Yeah, but the properties of the compound is different from the properties of its elements. Do you understand this? Yes. Okay. okay. Uh, another uh, example, the carbon dioxide. The carbon dioxide is made up of carbon and oxygen. Carbon only as an element is a black solid uh, substance, okay? Well, oxygen is a gas. When they join together, they form carbon dioxide, which is a gas. And the carbon lowahtu can solid black substance. Okay, not a gas. So the properties of the compound are different from the properties of its atoms. Do you understand this? Do you all understand this? Okay, let's complete. I still didn't explain the difference. How am I the difference between Yani? A fish comparison, my bain, a molecule compound, but I didn't explain the molecule yet. Okay. I will explain it when I finish the points when I, uh, uh, what I need to say. I will explain it or later on. Okay. So how am I in fashion? But if you compare them, between the molecule will compound. You will understand why later. Comparison the right. I am going to be all about between the element and the compound. Is it clear? The comparison between the element and the compound. Yeah. Okay. Let's complete. The right. If I told you, okay, an air. Air is made of what? Hmm. And someone. Is... It's made of uh, different kinds of gases. Yes, right. As what? As oxygen, nitrogen. As, oxygen, as nitrogen, nitrogen. As the water vapor dioxide. in the air. Right. Yes. Carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide. Right. But the air is made up of different gases. Okay, as Karim said, as oxygen, as water vapor, as nitrogen, carbon dioxide, and there are different uh, other gases here. Okay. You 
can say that air is an element, well, a compound, well, a name tail it. Is it element or compound or something else? The air is an element or a compound or something else. Hmm. What do you think? Yes. I think it's an element. Element, is it made of just one type of atom? We've just said that it's made up of oxygen and carbon dioxide. No, sorry, it's compound. Okay. Compound. Yeah. Okay. Those and oxygen, well, hydrogen, well, water, well, carbon dioxide. All of these atoms are joined together. Well, here different substances together. It's um, a mixture. They are different. Yes, they are here in the in the air. There are different gases. Some of them compounds, like carbon dioxide or water vapor. Some of them elements, like oxygen, like hydrogen, like nitrogen. When different substances, elements, or compounds are mixed together, we call them a mixture. We call them. We will make a mixture. An e mixture mixture is made up of different types of elements and the compounds mixed together. We breathe, from the air we could breathe in oxygen, so we could separate it. We could get the oxygen only, right, and gets out carbon dioxide. If uh, um, substances when they are easily separated, they make compound. Okay. Here we have different elements, such like as oxygen and hydrogen. Mixed with another compounds, the water with carbon dioxide. Kulum ma'bad, they are mixed together and they will make a mixture. They will make a mixture. So a mixture is made up of different types of elements or compound mixed in, mixed together. Okay? Had another example? Well, we didn't have to have to have to have to salty water. Okay, salty water. Salty water is considered as an element, well, a compound, well, a mixture. Huh. Need to hear your answers. Miss, may I answer? Okay, Karim, what's your answer? Uh, it's a mixture. Okay. Karim said it's a mixture. We have to answer Tanya. Salty water. Hmm. Yes. I also Hela. think it's a mixture. It's a mixture, okay. Had uh, you answered any a mixture? Yes. Ali, Caroline. Okay, yes. Salty water is a mixture. Can someone explain why? Yeah. I know. Uh, can someone explain why? Yes, yes, yeah, Karim. Uh, because it's. Uh has two compounds, water and uh, salt. Yes, excellent. They are mixed together and could be easily separated. And salty water is made up of salt. Thank you, Karim. Salty water is made up of salt and water. Okay, we, we could separate the salt from the water, right? By evaporating the water, salt will be left behind. So we could say that salty water is a mixture. Why? Because it's made up of a compound which is salt and another compound which is water and could be easily separated. If a different hen and the different compound, they are just mixed together and could, we could separate them. So we call it a mixture. If I said salt only, salt only, is a mixture, element or compound? Hmm. Salt only is what? It's a compound. Uh, yes, salt only is a compound. Well, water only is a compound. Okay? It's hard. Now, at the we have three words. The element, the compound, and the mixture. Element is a substance that is made up of just one type of atom. Okay? As the oxygen, as the carbon, as the gold, uh, as the silver. And the compound is a substance that is made up of two or more different elements. 
together or join together. A mixture is a substance that is made up of different elements and the compound they are mixed together and we could separate them. Okay. Do you hear okay, before about the alloys? Yes, yes, yes uh, Teacher, uh, like if we go uh, to be uh, oxygen, but in the soul, soul uh, in a liquid way, so uh, is the oxygen having another uh, element have been mixed with it or it's only uh, oxygen? It's just oxygen, okay? Any substance and they have melting or boiling point, okay? Any substance has melting and boiling point. So any substance, any element could be solid or liquid or gas. And if you have reached to the uh, freezing point that the oxygen, that the oxygen is solid. If we have reached to the melting point in the home, it can solid, it will be a liquid, even the oxygen, okay? Yani, any substance, any element, even if it was a gas, it could be solid and it could be liquid, and it will also stay as an a, stays an element. Why? Because it was made up of one type of atom. What is the It's a good question. What is the difference? It can be gas, or liquid, and it cooling down, and it solid. Was still oxygen, still oxygen atoms. In this case, the arrangement of the atoms. Okay, the arrangements of the atom will change. Yeah, if in solid particles, the atoms, if in solid state, sorry, the atoms will be tightly packed together. Like in the oxygen in the liquid state, atoms will slide over each other and there will be some spaces between them. And atoms in the gaseous state, will be far away from each other. But the atoms are still a oxygen atom, so it's still an element. Understand? Yeah. Uh, okay. Did you hear before about the alloys? Uh, you have taken this in grade four, right, in alloys? Who knows the meaning of alloys? Hmm. Yes. Okay, I will explain. Uh, we, you have taken before that steel is magnetic substance, right? The steel is a magnetic substance. The steel, fish element in the nature which is called steel. Okay, yani the iron, the wood, the nature is an element. Okay, but the steel, fish haga fil fil nature, the word ma steel. Steel is, is not an element. So what is the steel? Steel is made up when different metals are mixed together. Steel is made up of iron or another metal which is called the cobalt or another metal which is, is called the nickel. When we mix those three metals, we make a uh, steel. We call steel an alloy. What's the meaning of an alloy? Alloy is a mixture of metals. Alloy is made of mixtures of metals. Okay, mixture of metals. Type. The alloy differ from the metals in general. The alloys are harder than metals. Yani the steel is harder than the iron. Okay, well, properties that the steel are better than the properties of the iron. Oh, well, this cannot be rust. Yes, the steel, stainless steel, doesn't rust. Okay, so the steel is alloy. Okay, so what is the meaning of alloy? Alloy is a mixture of, it's made up of mixture of metals. The bronze also is an alloy because it's made up of mixture of metals. Okay, the alloy is an element. Well, a compound, well, a mixture. What do you think? Hmm. The alloy is an element, well, a compound, well, a mixture. I've explained the meaning of an alloy. So we call where alloy is what? Consider this one. Mixture. Yes, that's right. Alloy is considered as a mixture type. We said that uh, a, a mixture. It's made up of different elements and compounds or mixed, mixed together and could be easily separated. 
طب الميتلز في الالوي كود بي ايزلي سيباريتد يس الميتلز في الالوي كود بي سيباريتد اكوردنج تو ذا بويلينج بوينتس اوف ذا ميتلز اوكي الالويز بيحصل لها سيباريشن اكوردنج تو ذا ميلتينج بوينتس سوري ميلتينج بوينتس اوف ذا ميتلز اوكي فا وي كود سيباريت اتس ليمنتس فروم ايتش اذر يبقى في الميكستشر خلي بالكم الالمنتس هو الكومباوندز اللي ميكسد توجذر والالمنتس اللي ميكسد توجذر او الكومباوندز اللي ميكسد توجذر كود بي سيباريتد ايزلي لكن في الكومباوند الاتومز كودنت بي سيباريتد ايزلي يعني في الكومباوند اتس فيري ديفيكلت تو سيباريت فور اكزامبل كاربون دايكسيد از ا كومباوند كودنت سيباريت ايزلي ذا كاربون فروم ذا اكسجين يبقى في الكارب في في الكومباوند The atoms couldn't be separated easily. Like in the mixture, the elements and the compounds could be separated easily. As we said, as the salty water, for example, salty water is a mixture. Okay, made up of salt and water. We could separate salt from the water by evaporation of the water. Like in the water only, which is a compound, could we separate it easily? The hydrogen from the oxygen? No. But the difference, another difference between compound and mixture, the elements or the atoms that the compound couldn't be separated easily. Like in the uh, mixture, elements and compounds could be could separate them. Okay, understand this? Hago sabo? No. No. Ni ba l inta ko tus ala alim an awal das. Yani molecule. Molecule is when. Two or more atoms are joined together. Yani, for example, I'm a only anti O O2, O2 for oxygen. O O2. The difference ma binom hena the number of atoms. I'm a only just O. Second kena. Let me write on the screen. When I say, for example, O. When I say um, oh, it difference ma bin ha ma bin o. Difference ma bin ha ma bin o two. I'm afraid to do that. I'm just to show you the actual screen. Ha. It difference ma bin o o two. I know. Uh. Okay, yes, go ahead. The number of atoms. Yes, right. For O, how many atoms? One. Oh, we have just one atom, right. O, two. Two atoms. We have two atoms, right? For O, two, in O, two, we have two atoms. When two or more atoms are joined together, we call it molecule. Yeah, and here O just O decay the oxygen atom. Like in O two, we saved oxygen molecule. Yeah, and a molecule when two or more atoms are joined together, they will make a molecule. Okay, right. For example, Mas, another example. H, H is the symbol for the hydrogen. Okay, where H, H two. It difference between H to H two. Huh. Alec, Dimas, Jana, Ferris, yes. What is the difference between H and H two? What do you think? Yes. Miss H is one atom of hydrogen, but yes. H two is Just two atoms. Hydrogen atom. H just one hydrogen atom. And H2, two hydrogen atoms. Type. So I'm going to say H only is a hydrogen atom. But in H2, I'm going to say hydrogen A, hydrogen molecule. H2, I'm going to say hydrogen molecule. There's a substance that is called sulfur. Okay, the symbol for sulfur is S. We have S and S8. Difference between S to S8. Huh. S. S only is a sulfur atom. Like in S8, we have how many atoms? S8, this means that we have eight atoms of sulfur. So S8 is a molecule. 
يبقى when two or more atoms are joined together, we call it a molecule. The molecule D could be for an element, and also could be for a compound. The molecule could be for an element, and also could be for a compound. How it could be for a compound? يبقى كلهم elements. O2, oxygen molecule for an element. H2, hydrogen molecule. It's a molecule for an element. S8, sulfur molecule for an element. Okay? في حاجة هنا بس قبل ما يعني أعمل المولكيول بتاعة compound after before I explain it. في حاجة هنا difficult? Is it clear? Difference between O O two, between the atom and the molecule. Okay. Yes. When two or more atoms are joined together, we call it molecule. Okay. Type. For drawing here, for for diagram, da. How many can atom here join together? How many atoms are here? Two. Two. Two atoms are joined together. Yes, that's right, bro. So we call it molecule. This element is made up of molecules. Fine. عرفت منين إن ذا element. The atoms هنا are of the same shape and the same kind or not. They are of the same shape and the same time. So, from this diagram, we knew that those molecules are for an element. عرفت منين إنهم just يعني the molecules of the element عشان هما same type of atoms. It's all it's made up of same type of atom. So that's how we knew that it's an element. Okay? And I'll leave a little calendar. Alashain Said for exam, be big diagrams. We will like label them. Or, for example, the diagrams are the letters A, B, C, D. And he will ask you later in the questions which diagram is made up of, um, which diagram is an element, which diagram is a compound, which diagram is a mixture. Okay, so here, this diagram, it's made up of atoms. All of them are of the same color. So they are of the same type. So here, the, those atoms are for an element. And here also, those molecules, why did we say molecules? Because it's made up of two or more atoms joined together. So those molecules are also for an element, okay? Different type, okay. In this compound, it's made the yani. This is, um. Diagram for water, H2O. In H2O, how many atoms are here bonded together? We have two hydrogen and one oxygen. We call all of this molecule. We call all of this a water molecule. Why do we call it a molecule? It's a compound. Okay, عشان it's made up of different types of atoms. يعني إيه molecule? When two or more atoms are joined together. The molecule D could be for an element or could be for a compound. Enter the element to enter the compound. Say, for example, in the fact, on O2, made up of the two atoms of oxygen. Now, the atoms are of the same type. If a D molecule for an element. Here, this diagram. Are the atoms here are of the same type? Atoms that are joined here together are of the same type? No. No. So. It's a molecule for a compound. If a molecule, I don't want to make a comparison between them and between the compound. Why? Because the meaning of the molecule is when two or more atoms are joined together, they will make a molecule. The atoms D could be of the same type or could be for different type as here in this case. So here, those are molecules for a compound. Again, the meaning of when two or more atoms are joined together, they will make a molecule. If those atoms are different, as in this case, so though here is the diagram of molecules of a compound. Okay? If 
In this case, atoms are of the same type. You here the molecule of an element. Why we said that the molecule of an atom? Because it's made up of same types of atoms. Okay. Miss. Yes. Yes, you can. Are all compounds uh, are molecule? Yes, of course. Of. In the compound, the lesson you want two or more different types of atoms bonded together. Oh, them and the two or more atoms bonded together. For lesson of compound, you get you can made up of molecules. That's right. Excellent. Okay. The carbon dioxide, CO two, and three three atoms. If it will make a molecule. Okay. And the uh, sodium chloride, as I said, that our table salt made up of sodium and the chloride for the two different atoms bonded together. So compound less than diamond you can more Okay. Is there anything difficult? No. Okay. Um we will now have a sheet which is made up of questions and we will answer it together. Okay? I will ask you and you will answer. Just a second, I will I'm preparing it. Okay. It's a story. Okay, here is asking you to take one box. And the first one has been done for you. It's 2 O. Water is a compound. Why do we say it's a compound? Because it's made up of two different atoms bonded together. Okay? Hi. So Haida, the second one. Carbon dioxide is an element or compound? Carbon dioxide is an element. Okay, look again to the symbol. Carbon dioxide. How many different atoms are here? We have carbon and? Dioxide, so it's a compound. Carbon and oxygen. So here, we don't have just one type of atom. No, we have carbon and oxygen. When two or more different types of atoms are bonded together, they will make an, uh, sorry, they will make a compound. Okay, do you understand this? Yeah, it's okay. Okay, remiss. Hmm. Yes. The hydrogen. Hello? It's a compound. Yes, hydrogen is a compound, yes. Hydrogen is a compound. Is that right? Hydrogen is a compound? Uh, no. Look here. Hydrogen is made up of what? It's just one type of atom. We'll take the symbols later. But here you can see that hydrogen is made up of hydrogen. Fee another element atom I have? Well, just hydrogen. That's Fiery mess. Just hydrogen. Fine. If I have a type of atom here. One. But element or a compound? Element. Yes. Do you understand? Yes. Okay. Bye. Right? Bye. Yes. Helium. Helium. 
helium compound compound helium only اتش اي ده الاسمنت بتاعت الهيليوم كلها على بعض اوكي مفيش ديفرنت المنت يعني هي كلها هيليوم على بعضها بس هيليوم اونلي حاجه ثانيه معايا هيليوم المنت ولا كومباوند ها بس يبقى يكون المنت يس واي بيكوز ات جاست ميد اب اوف فون تايب اوف فين المغنيزيوم جانا اشرف المغنيزيوم جانا ها جانا كارولين مغنيزيوم مغنيزيوم از ا ماتل مجين دي سمبل كلها بتاعت مغنيزيوم بس ماتل كارولين Okay. Hmm. Who could answer? Yes, you can. It's an element. Magnesium is an element. Why? Because it's just made up of one type of atom. Okay? Okay. Let's complete the sheet. Draw a line from each group to the correct description. And see Walter. <coughs> Let's um, uh, match the group then to the description. Okay. Uh, yes. Yes, here you missed. Okay, next one. Sea water, huh? Sea water. So, sea water is a pure water or salty water, here you missed? Uh, it's a salty water. So, the compound or mixture or element? A mixture. Yes, excellent. It's a mixture. And what's the description? If you're found. Two, uh, uh, two or more types of atoms are chemically joined together. Chemically joined? They are chemically joined. We cannot separate them easily. Oh, it's, uh, it's the first one. Yes, which could be here. It contains two or more types of Atoms or molecules which can be physically separated. Yani, if physically separated by physical means, say evaporation or condensation or freezing. Okay? Those are yes. the physical means. So it could be separated easily by evaporation. Thank you. Hayya Karim, the salt. We said that it's sodium chloride. Hayya Karim. It's a compound. It's a compound. Why? What's the description? Because it has two different atoms. Um, yes, two, uh, two or more types of atoms are chemically, chemically doing together. And the last one, which is oxygen, is an element, of course, because it contains only one type of atom. Okay? Okay. This, uh, <clears throat> okay. So, Haila, the symbol for the element oxygen is O. How many atoms are in an oxygen molecule? O2. How many atoms are here? Two. Sorry? Two. Oh, yes. Here, O2, how did we know from the number? Underneath the symbol, we will take this later in details. In numbers, when symbols were predictable, we will take this later. Okay. okay. Use these three diagrams to answer the questions below. Which of these substances is a compound? We have A, B, and C. Caroline. Huh. 
Okay. Which one do you think it's a compound, Yabai? Yeah, Arbor. Uh, C. C, Y. That's right. Excellent. Why? Because you it has what? two or more uh, atoms. Yes, the here, the molecule is made up of different types of A, different types of atoms. And how small dual types atom or large one is different types of atoms. But molecule here is made up of two different types of atoms. Thank you, Adai. So here, which of these substances is a compound? It's what? It's C. Which of these substances could be oxygen? Huh? Yes, yeah, Karim. B. B, yes. Why? Why? Because it's made up of two atoms. Yes. Two uh, atoms. Yes, a molecule of the oxygen made is made up here of two similar atoms. Often name back a man, Yanni, and here, Masalam uh, Hinabardu, he is an element, to be also is an element. Often in the oxygen, and the molecules are of a gas. They are far away from each other. Okay, that's why we said that it could be oxygen. Which two substances are only made of one type of atom? Yes, Yerimes, huh? Um, A and B. A and B, excellent. Because they are the, here the atoms are of the same type. A also at the same type. What is the name given to the substance that only contain one type of atom? Huh. The name given to the substance that contains, yes, yes, Suhaila. Huh. Substance that is made up of just Element. one type of atom? Element, Element. thank you. Element, yes. Um, let's complete. The diagram re represent the arrangement of atoms or molecules in four different substances. Okay. Which here? Which substance is a compound? Uh, Nore? Okay. Yes, yeah, Nore. Do you know the answer? Uh, yes, it's B. Uh, okay, compound means that the substance that is made up of different types of atoms bonded together. B here, the shading of the atoms is the same, huh? B, the shading for the atoms is the oh, same. So sorry, it's I didn't different. notice. Okay. Yeah, um, it's, it's C, right? Yes, it's C, it excellent. C? C, yes. Well, which substance is a compound? C, because it's the molecule here of this compound is made up of a two different types of atoms. Thank you. Okay. Which substance is a mixture? Right? Yeah, right. Which substance is a mixture? Like, who knows the answer? Yes, yes, yes. I think it's D. Yes, D. Yes, that's right. Why D? Because here it's made up of a different types of atoms and they are mixed together. Here they are not chemically bonded. Okay, fine. D alloy. It's D is a diagram for an alloy. حاجة كمان بتفرق المكتشر ما بين ما بينه وما بين الكومباوند في الكومباوند بتبقى repeated with the same pattern يعني هنا كلهم نفس الشكل لكن في دي they are not repeated in the same pattern okay so D is a mixture that's right كريم which two substances are elements it's A and C and B yes A and B that's right thank you and B. Which substance could be carbon dioxide? Haida, yes. Huh? Yes, Haida. 
Yes, teacher. Which substance could be carbon dioxide? I think B. Yes, C. Because carbon dioxide is made up of one carbon atom, two oxygen atom, and C here is the compound that we have here, and it's made up of one carbon atom, the two oxygen atom. Okay. Do you have a No. You had the um, explanation that you had No. Okay. That can lesson the elements for mixture well compound and its application. Okay. Uh, now I have finished. Do you have any questions? No. Okay. Thank you all for listening. Um, inshallah, yeah, thank you. you Yes. Thank you. Thank you're you. welcome. You're most welcome. <laughs> you're welcome. I'll see you later, inshallah. Okay. Right. Um, no. Hmm, so be